So, uh, about a week or so ago, I finished watching a show called Baki, and I was very confused. It's an anime on Netflix. It's a fighting anime. And, yeah, it was pretty good, but it was also really stupid, but it was, you know, not bad. Um, <clears throat> but I was very confused because, for one thing, uh, even though Baki is the main character, he only fights, like, three times in the entire first season of the show. Apparently, this might be a sequel to an earlier animated series, but I didn't watch it. So I came into this blind. All these additional characters that you have no idea who they are. And every time there was a fight, like if one guy lost, another dude showed up and would fight. And then sometimes the bad guys would get away. Sometimes the bad guys would beat everybody. And it was just like, what am I watching? The, the fighting was good. Um, it was a bit silly at times. And the music was good. But not knowing anyone or anything and trying to just follow the story was kind of hard. And I didn't watch season two yet because I was kind of like, I don't know if I want to keep watching. And my youngest right now, he is eating his breakfast right here. So that noise you're hearing is him. But this is the first time I've had a little bit of time to record a video other than the shorts that I've uh, sporadically posted. And I wanted to try to get back into the habit of posting stuff. And um, so uh, the story is out of the blue, five criminals who are all death row inmates at various prisons across the world break out of prison and head to Japan to find somebody who can defeat them in battle. And you're introduced to Baki, and he's like, you know, he, he, he just won a tournament, and he's supposed to be, there's some sort of toy. Great. So there's some sort of toy underneath me uh, on the couch. It must be one of the kids put it underneath the cushion. Um, so that was fun. But, um, so, it starts off with these five. They break out of prison and they all start showing up and start wrecking havoc and Baki and a couple other like super strong fighters are all supposed to get together and fight these five bad guys except they don't like like Baki does like he fights one early on and then the fight stops and then he fights a different one later on but for the most part it's everybody else of these other characters and um, it's just like it was really hard to follow at first without having seen whatever the previous iteration of Baki was. And after finishing it, I was like, it's not bad, but I think I'm just a little too lost watching it. And even though the fighting was good, the story was really stupid. Um, but if you want to watch a good quick anime with some good fights, I would suggest watching Baki, but it's not the most brilliant story. It's kind of wacky and it, I thought it was okay. Um, but yeah, that was my quick little review for Baki and maybe I'll go back and watch season two. Maybe that'll be a little bit better. It was just a little weird, especially at the end of this first season. You get introduced to another new character who apparently is the son of Muhammad Ali. And, um, you know, it's just like, uh, you know, I don't know. But anyways, have a good one.